Let's take a look now at a busy Saturday around the Magic City, starting at Montana Fair. It's the last day of Montana Fair. We're here at the Expo Center. The kids are getting their animals ready to auction off in the Junior Livestock Show. Macy Mosher gets sniffed ready for the show. I'm selling him today. He is a black Angus cross. His name is Snip. And he has a white spot on his nose. He weighs $14.96. 4 H and raising Snip have brought some good lessons. A bunch of confidence. Responsibility, understanding what the process is. Macy did a good job feeding her steer. Look at him. It's super important uh, to learn where their where their food comes from, where their where their meal comes from. Having a good work ethic and the rewards that come with that, and the and they learn responsibility and, and how to become a real productive citizen. And at the end of the day, you go shake your competitors' hand that beat you and say good job, and I'll get you next time. And I think it's. Uh, Kind of, it's kind of the American way. Joe Goggins is one of the auctioneers. The Patrick K. Goggins Junior Livestock Sale is named after Joe's dad. He uh, loved youth, loved competition, uh, and loved this community. My mom's here, 90 years old, uh, has 13 great grandkids uh, that have steers here. So it's, got, it's, it's kind of an emotional day for us as well. And Macy is one of the great grandchildren. It's pretty special. It's a cool thing to be able to participate in something that your great grandpa helped start. Give me three now, quarter. These kids in this barn will be in the in the future. They're they're getting groomed to be the leaders of this country. In Billings, David J, MTNU.